is our last day in Dubai and of our entire Middle Eastern trip, and it's gonna be an awesome day. So before we came to Dubai, we heard basically like the only thing to do here was go to malls and go to deserts. And somehow we've been here for more than three weeks and we have yet to go to a mall. So we're just packing it all into one day. Today we're doing two of the coolest things that you could possibly do in a mall in our opinion. Let's go. Welcome to the Mall of the Emirates. In our opinion, the coolest thing that you could possibly do inside this mall is go skiing. Let's just take a minute to appreciate that you can go skiing inside a mall that is built basically in the middle of the desert. I've skied about three times in my whole life. Should be interesting. Scientists, show this your recipe. Thank you. So I kind of feel like I've been transported to a ski lodge, except I'm still wearing sandals. The good thing about this place is you don't have to bring your own ski clothes because it would be silly to do that in the desert. They have them for you. Socks. Nice, thank you. And let's go skiing. Wait, safety first. Ow! What size is this? <laughs> this is crazy. We are inside a mall, there is snow, Kara doesn't know how to ski. I really don't, I'm really nervous. This is gonna be so much fun. How do you feel? Uncoordinated. Oh wow, he's good. <gasps> wow! Did you see that? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Are you nervous? No, I'm really excited. I'm so nervous. You just taught me how to pizza the whole way down. Let's just hope I don't hurt myself. I'm gonna get it on video if you do. You better. Good luck. I love you, don't hurt yourself. We have a lot of fun things to do this year. Yeah. Don't want to spin in the hospital. Keep it like that. Keep it like that. All the way down. All the way down. Yeah. Yeah. She's so good. Forward, forward. Yes. Oh, you practically stopped yourself on the hill. That's impressive. Kara's gonna practice on the bunny slope a little bit while I head to the top. I'm not bad at snowboarding, but I'm definitely not good enough to make it look cool on the camera, but I'll do my best. Also, the only thing they don't provide you here with is gloves. I already can't film on fingers. What'd I tell ya? I get enough to film and snowboard. This girl's going to find a bunny slope. Okay. Here we go. Go, Kara! How was the bunny slope? I did the level two bunny slope and I stopped it all the way down. So we thought that they would just give us, I don't know, what are those big things called? Like a parka. I thought we were getting parkas for the most part. So I wore a cardigan like and a, a tank top. A jogging jacket. We were better and we kept moving and we didn't fall in the snow, it's probably good. I haven't fallen yet, except for when I got off the ski lift. <laughs> you're not trying hard enough. You gotta get out there and go for it. I am trying, I did the level two bunny. <laughs> Are you gonna ride the ski lift with, with me? So cool, I can't talk. Ski lift right. time. That was so good. All right, last one. Gonna make it a good one. That was so much fun, and Carrie, you did so good. Thanks. Does that mean that like maybe one day you'll go real skiing with me? Maybe. Welcome to the Dubai Mall. The fun's not over yet. This is a Dubai Aquarium. It is 10 million liters, which is big enough to scuba dive in, and that's what we're about to do, with sharks. Huge sharks. Scary sharks. Let's go. This is without a doubt going to be the largest audience we have ever had while scuba diving. 
I hope we nail the buoyancy and don't look like beginners. <laughs> yeah. Sinking down to the bottom, floating back up to the top. Slow breathing. So we just finished our dive briefing. We had this 10 page book about how to interact with the sharks in the tank. I want to read you my favorite line of the book. Other than smell and hearing, all of their senses only have a one to two meter range in the aquarium due to multiple interferences by pumps and other equipment. Therefore, when the sharks swim directly at you, don't misinterpret this as aggression. They just haven't sensed you yet. This should be a lot of fun. Absolutely incredible. I seriously will never forget the look of how close a shark is right next to my face. You don't have good peripheral vision when you're wearing goggles, so it's like all of a sudden you would turn your head and you would be face to face with a shark. So you could see all the people in the mall and in the tunnel and they'd be like waving and so I'd start waving at like the kids and stuff and then I'd realize Oh no, there might be a shark like, right next to me. Because so, you constantly have to look like up, down, side, like they're everywhere. It but, was insane. And, and being able to interact with the people in the mall was like one of the most fun parts. There were little kids that come up and they'd touch their hand to the other side of the glass. It was the cutest. People would wave at you to like, see if you were paying attention to them. The next coolest thing after the sharks was the stingray that was bigger than I was. I just couldn't even believe that I was that close in the water with an animal. And for some reason you thought it was a good idea to swim right over the top of it. And we have this clip, it's one of my favorite, and it's Kara when she realizes that a shark is like right above her and you can see how big her eyeballs are through her mask. <laughs> just like they would come out of nowhere. But I felt so safe. Like the two guides who were with us knew they exactly were what they were doing. They would put us in a place and tell us to wait because apparently the sharks kind of have like a circle that they have like a routine. And so they'd tell us to wait there and then one would 
wind like right above our heads. Also, I wasn't sure how I would feel diving in an aquarium as opposed to open water. I thought like, oh, being in an aquarium might be kind of lame, but not at all. No. It was like all of the best parts of open water diving packed into like one tiny area. It was fantastic. Thank you Dubai Aquarium for having us. That was the best experience ever. And like a fantastic grand finale to our 20 plus days in the Gulf States. There's also a Zorb. Nice. Bye. Oh, keep rolling. Okay. Turn over. He said keep rolling. Here, yeah, what size fits your head? Not a large. <laughs> what do I do? I don't know. Woo. I did it. Oh, he's good. Oh, she's good. I'm intimidated. She's really good too.